Chris, what's your feelings after a game of highs and lows throughout the 90 minutes? No, it was a really emotional game. We we go into half-time not uh, really happy with conceding uh, the goal and uh, we felt we, we had a lot of the ball but didn't create enough chances. But then we bounced back twice and uh, we got a really positive feeling uh, towards the end of the game. But then we're... We can see that another penalty, so it's a uh, it's a shame we, we only get a point from the from the game. Obviously, we lost the penalty just before half time, but having got back into the game, Aberdeen's second goal seemed to come out of nowhere. Yeah, I think I think we we bounced back really well. Griff scored a great goal. Uh, Tom and uh, Cal combined really well to score the first goal. So I felt like we were really really get going getting going there. But then then they're uh, they're always uh, dangerous on the break. They got the really a few really skillful players up front there, so uh, that can hurt you, and they and they, and they did today. And uh, Petrodri, we, we quite often see you in an attacking sense. We've seen it before when you scored. Saw it there today. That brilliant move down the right hand side to set up the penalty. Yeah, I was uh, delighted with that, but uh, I'm never delighted when we when we concede three goals. We've uh, conceded too many goals last last week, and we we have to change that. And just a case now of the team just sticking together, working hard, and, and you know just ironing out those maybe giving away teams goals at the back. Yeah, this this is a great bunch of uh, players that's been through so much the last the last few years. So we always stick together. We uh, we work hard every single day in training, and we will get back to getting the three points uh, already next week.